Some people are traveling back home after the holidays and our Brianna Ray Turner is out at Jacksonville International Airport tonight. And Brianna, we've been hearing all about the delays and frustration cancellations leading up to the holiday, but what are you seeing now out there? Yeah, well, Jeannie, after talking with some people here, I'm starting to hear more delays than cancellation. Now, travelers are telling me that these delays are ranging about 20 minutes to about a few or a couple hours. So um, definitely um, a lot of delays. But um, just to give you a quick look, if you take a look behind me, we're looking at Southwest. There's one cancellation for them, and then there's another, which is United, and that also has a cancellation. I talked with the traveler, Terry Schumann, who says she came to Jacksonville to see her family for the holidays. And today she's going to be back in Michigan, but she was one of the people who ran into an issue. Her flight was delayed by two hours, but she says it all worked out. I do believe this morning my daughter got a text fine. He <laughs> gave me a couple extra hours to spend with her. <laughs> so. So if you do plan on traveling, just keep updated with your flight. Check your phone and check your emails. I'm live here at the Jacksonville International Airport. Brianna Ray Turner, First Coast News on your side. Brianna, thank you.